So guys, we are, we are done with the meals and we've paid the bills. And guess who we bumped into? We bumped into Christmas list. Yes. <laughs> and we are so excited here. So we both we both chose the best restaurant. Yeah, this is Zambezi. Yeah. Oh, do you love Zambezi? Yeah. You normally eat here? We come here almost every day, yeah. Okay. Yeah, they're offering very nice meals, very fresh. Yeah, it was good. And um, very affordable places. Yeah. Yeah, so what did you eat today? Uh chicken. Chicken with rice and chapati. Chicken and rice and chapati. Chapati. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Wow, so for us we ate ugali. Yeah. Uh, vegetables and meat. Yes. Yeah. See, I love I love ugali, but I can only eat it one one day a week. It's very heavy for me. <laughs> too much calories. Uh, not too much calories. I just feel weighed down. <laughs> okay. Wow. So we now I'm not gonna offend some people from Kenya when I say that, but I like it just <laughs> one, once in a while, not every day. Yeah, I know. But with time, if yeah. you stay here longer, maybe you'll um, embrace it. I've been here many times. This yeah. is not my first time in Kenya. Yes. And I've been all over Africa. Okay. So I've uh, I've eaten it quite a few times. Okay. So how long are you going to stay in the village? Yes, I don't know. Maybe maybe another week. Another week. Something like that. Okay. I, I take it day by day. A day by day. Oh, yeah. The way the day comes. Yeah. As long as I have videos to shoot, then I'll, I'll hang around. Wow. So so far, which is your favorite meal around here? Your favorite meal? I like gold. Meal? Anything gold, I like. And anything, anything good. Yeah, and chapati, I really like too. Oh, oh chapati. Yeah. Wow. But I really eat the same thing almost every day. So. Okay. I don't know. Cool. Yeah. Goat, chicken, fish. Mm -hmm. Not much. Not much else. Okay. Wow. Oh, so that is. I wanted to show some some people your. Your cape. My hat. Your hat. So it's written, not your average tourist. And yeah. for real, this is not your average tourist. Yeah. Because Chris is a head he is a hardcore traveler. Yeah. Like now you can see me in the village tomorrow or the next week. <laughs> Jamaica. Yeah. Somalia. Everywhere. So where do you plan to go after this? My rough plan, mm -hmm. I'd like to go to Congo. Congo. South Congo. Sudan. Wow. Nigeria. And Nigeria. After here from here, yeah. Okay. But that could change. I didn't buy a ticket yet, so okay. we'll see what happens. Okay. But I'll get lost somewhere, ah. somewhere across Africa. Wow. I've, I've visited about 20 countries so far yes. in Africa, so I want to I wanna see some new ones. Yeah. Like now, I always see you every day you're on the road. Yeah. Do you really miss home? I know your home is in Canada. Yeah. So how, how much time do you spend uh, at home, maybe I, in a year? I normally travel a month, and then I go home for a month. Oh, you travel? I travel about six months out of the year. So which means you're a rich guy? I don't know. <laughs> Guess it depends what rich means. Oh, my, maybe you you have resources because so traveling, YouTube, traveling YouTube means pays, no YouTube pays me well. Oh, YouTube pays you well. Yeah, yeah. Wow, wow. And I can see you are a generous man. Like that day you were following on the cows, yeah. the cows which were stolen. Yeah. And you decide? Can you maybe speak something a little about it? Because yeah. Uh, well, we just found out that some strangers were looking for their cows. Yes. So we followed them for the day. Yes. And at the end of the day, they didn't they didn't find their cows. Yes. So yesterday we went to the market and bought new cows and brought them yesterday. Wow. That is so generous. Of so today's video on my channel is going to be giving the cows to the strangers. Wow. How many cows? Two cows, two goats, two and cows, then some food like flour and sugar and oil and okay maize. Wow. Wow, what motivates you to give? Because you're always giving. You're a yeah. giver. You're a giver. You always give. Because I can. Uh -huh. But even when I had no money, I would give. You still give. If I have $100 in my bank and I see somebody is hungry, mm -hmm. I'll give them 50 Yeah. I know I can make the money back. Oh, yeah. Right? And, I, and I've gone through parts of my life where I didn't have money. Wow. So I understand that people need help. Yeah. So I have rules, though. If somebody asks me for money, I don't give it to them. Okay. If this lady came and said, can I have money? No. <laughs> you just I, give away subs. I, I pick and choose people that I feel are deserving. Yeah. I just think if you give money to beggars, they're just going to keep, they're going to beg. They're never going to try to change their life. True. So I, I don't. Uh, and I, I don't have enough money to give to everybody. It's impossible, I, right? Yeah, very true. Like I remember there's a time you were in Somalia. Yeah. And you generously gave uh, some kids money. And yeah. then people were like, why, why are you doing this? You know what? It's a sad world we live in. You know, uh, yeah. even yeah. with buying cows yesterday, I put an announcement on my community yes. board on YouTube that, hey, we brought the cows back. It will be in the next video. Yes. And there's some hatred. Mm -hmm. You know, I got a few comments like, white man, leave Africa. We don't want your cows. Uh -huh. uh, it's life, you know. I don't, I don't, I don't base a country yeah. of Kenya or the continent of Africa based on one or two stupid people. Uh -huh. uh, it doesn't make sense. But there is a lot of negativity in the world. Yeah. How can I help you and you find something negative to say about me? 
so so sad. Right, but that's what happened in Somalia. It's life. Who yeah. doesn't bother me? But I like the way you choose posit positivity. Yeah, you, you have never to. concentrate on the negative uh, side. You only concentrate on the positive. Yeah, those negative people. And need it a, keeps you moving. They need a big hug. I feel sorry for them. <laughs> they're they're mad so at life, right? They, they, they are the ones who have problems, not yeah. you. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, I have no problem. Wow. So thank you so much, Chris, for yeah. appearing in my man. I, what I must say is, you ask better questions than everybody else. Really? So congratulations, because uh, when I'm at the at, at Marwa's house, it's the same questions over and over again. Uh -huh. Excited for the party? Uh -huh. uh, are you gonna dance at the party? Uh, uh -huh. What are you looking for for it most about the party? Uh -huh. yeah. So you're saying my, my questions are better? Yeah, much better. Okay. We talked about something I had not, have not talked about, and I've done a hundred interviews since I've been at Marwa's house. And wow. Yeah, you've added something different. So wow. Keep doing what you're doing, and let me give you advice for you too. Please give Here's me. my advice, what I've learned. Yeah, I'm listening. Just, the I'm just the about to hit 200,000 subscribers. Yes. And I'm going to give Marwa 100% the credit of what I'm about to tell you. Because this is what he taught me a year ago. Yes. Be the star of your show. Be the star. You're the star. Yes. Okay? So if you're going to Tanzania to film, it's you going to Tanzania. Yes. It's not The video's not about Tanzania. The it's video's me. about you yes. going to Tanzania. Wow. You're the star. I'm the star. If you have Christmas list, the title's not about Christmas list interview. No, you going to Tanzania, but Chris is a, make a little appearance. Yeah, you're the star. I'm the co-star. He's the co-star. Yeah, always. Because what you do is you build an audience of people that care about you. Yes. Lastly, show the ups and the downs. If you're having a shitty day, yes. You have no money in your pocket. You're broke. Yes. You talk about it on your channel. Wow. Guys, I'm going through some real rough times right now. Wow. This is going to be challenging. I only have. 200 Kenyan shillings to last me the week. Yes. Hopefully I can get through it. Yes. And you share that story. Yes. Too many people are embarrassed of the truth. Wow. Right? So they try to only show the positive yes. in the story. When in reality, if you want to build an audience that cares about you, yes. when you're crying at home because something's upset you, somebody passed away, yes. that's the kind of stuff that you got to vlog. Wow. And then you build an audience that cares about you, not the location that you go to. Okay. Right? Then you don't focus on collaborations. You're the star. I'm the you star. You know who's the star in Marwa's videos? Marwa. Marwa's the star. If he's walking down the street and nobody's there, people will watch him. Yeah. Because he's created himself as a star. He's the so star. that's my advice to you. You be the star. Show everything. Ups, downs, goods, bads. Um, yeah. And people will watch. Thank you so much. I'm going to take that advice so seriously. And I know it will help me. Yes. Like, uh, right, let me ask you, what did you do when uh, maybe you didn't have views when you started? What did you do to better each and every day? What did you do? Just try to create better content. Better the content. reason you don't have good views is because your videos are no good. <laughs> like, <laughs> okay. this, is the, this is the answer. Mm -hmm. Do you ever play a sport? Pardon? Do you ever play sports? Growing up, you play football? Oh, yes. So. What happens if you're not getting goals? Why are you not getting goals? Maybe I'm not playing well. Yeah, you're not good enough. <laughs> okay. Right? Too many people are looking for a different reason. No, your videos are not good enough. Mm -hmm. So once your videos start getting good, mm -hmm. you're gonna you're gonna get more views. Don't worry about it. Okay. Imagine I give you a football for the first time in your life. The first time in your life. Yes. And you're telling me after a week, mm -hmm. I'm not getting any goals. Of course you're not getting goals. You need to practice. You need to practice for years. Mm -hmm. You might get a video that does well here and there. Yes. But I mean, if you want to make this a business and a career, mm -hmm. just keep putting out good videos. Get better, get better, get better, get better. Wow. Wow. And I'm still practicing. I'm still learning myself. Yes. I have so much to learn. Mm -hmm. Right? That's why I like being around Marwa. He's a different type of traveler than me, different type of vlogger than me. But I can still learn so much. Yeah. Yeah. I always watch your videos. And I wonder, like, which which software do you use to edit your it's video? It's iMovie. It's a very basic, you know, free software that comes with Apple. iMovie. Yeah, I don't overly edit either. Okay. It's very basic editing. Okay. I want you to feel like you're there. Wow. If it's over edited, I don't feel like you're there. I don't add music. Okay. Ninety nine percent of the time, I don't add music. I want you to feel like you're really there. Okay. There's never been a time in my life where I'm, music just appears out of nowhere. Yeah. So I want to make my vlogs as real as possible. Wow. Oh, I'm I'm really learning. So they better be without music because it will be so real. Yeah. So raw and. Uh, and you don't even the music that you use now might be not copyright. Yes. But how about three years down the road if they copyright that music? What? And then your videos are gone because you put music everywhere, right? Oh yeah. There's there's too much to lose. Nothing to. I'm Nobody's coming to your channel mm -hmm. to listen to music. And yeah. how about if you play African beats? 
and the person watching it doesn't like African beats, they close your window, they close the, or you're playing techno and they don't like techno, oh, or you're yeah. playing drum and beat. There's too many people to yes. please. Yes. Music to me is not. Wow. wow. The best, the best of the best of this travel, mm -hmm. nobody uses music. Okay. So I'll follow their lead. I'm not using music. Okay. So Chris, you are a big YouTuber. No, oh, but small, very small. <laughs> I like that Very because you, you're aiming somewhere, right? Yeah, my aim is so, let much, me ask you much greater. YouTube is so big. Yeah. So Chris, where do you see yourself in the next in the next one year? A million. My goal is a million. A million. A million subscribers. Wow. Yeah. I won't sleep until I get <laughs> I get, until until I get, get to a million. million. Yeah. Because then I'll feel, finally feel like I'm uh, I'm achieving. Because right now it's all practice. Yeah. All of this is practice. Practice. Until I get to a million. Wow. Wow. I really like. So guys, you can see I'm I'm next to the next. One million yeah, subscribers. Maybe not, maybe not the next one million, but I'll be there. You'll be there. I'll be there. Yeah. So right now I'm at 3,500. Yeah. And my goal is to reach 5,000, then from there 10,000. You know, forget your goal. I know it's, we're all like that. We, we set a goal. Yes. Make your goal to create better videos. Okay. Every day. Your goal is to create a better video. Create better v videos than, than even chasing subscribers? Yeah. Wow. Because if I create better videos, Automatically, the, the subscribers will come, right? Even the way you hold the camera. Yes. Everything should be thought out, okay? Because we're sitting here right now. We know what this looks like, right? Mm -hmm. So if I'm sitting here yes. and I have a question for you, if I'm sitting in the same position too long, mm -hmm. the person watching gets boring. Whoa. So you want to point around. You want to show people what it looks like. like look. Oh, yeah. oh, look at that. Point. Come closer. Ah. Right? Come back. Uh -huh. Oh, and I oh, that's the butcher shop. Let me go over there and see how they're cutting up the meat. Yes. Okay, what did you think? What did you have to eat today? Ugali, meat, and veggies. Okay. Did you hear that? Ugali. Of course he ate ugali. Right? We're in Kenya. What else would you... He's a staple food of Kenya. Yeah. Right? And then look. Okay, uh, what would you suggest others to order when they're here? Uh, they can try things like rice. Yeah. Chapati. Chapati. No, no. I'm okay. just showing you that I'm moving around. Oh yeah. yeah. Chapati. Yeah. Wait, wait a sec. Beans. For the, for those people that are not in Kenya, what does what is chapati? What does it look like? What does it taste like? Chapati is the wheat, wheat that is rolled. It's like roti of the Indian, but with a lot of maybe lots of uh, ingredients than the roti. Yeah. So it's um, flour, which is not even flour. It's what? Uh, wheat flour. Wheat flour. Yeah. That is wheat flour that is rolled, and then. I uh, put on pan. Yes. And then that is it. Yes. Yeah. So you heard it here first. If you come to Kenya, no doubt you have to try chapati. Yeah, chapati. Now, do you see how much movement there was with the camera? Yeah. I got you involved. Yeah. yeah. I came closer. I came further away. I stopped to emphasize on certain things. Yeah. For those watching that are not from Africa, let me talk to you about chapati. Yeah. You can say, I remember when I was a child. You know, all I had to eat on Mondays and Wednesdays were chapati. But you see, the storytelling involves. You're the director of the video. If I'm like this for 15 minutes, they don't know that the walls are pink. They don't know that there's, you know, some dirt up there. They don't know that that man's making noise. You could say, I apologize, there's some noise in the back. The man's collecting the old bottles. Yeah. Now you're involving them in your life. Yes. This, you're the movie star. You gotta explain what's happening around. I would get up, show the butcher shop. I would go inside and ask, where's the guy from the butcher shop? Uh -huh. I ask him a few questions. Yeah. Wow. But like, look, I'm involving everything. Yes. Not just, this, this gets boring. Wow. Unless I'm like <laughs> a president of a country, or, but your YouTube vlogging style. Yes. I would say five seconds. There's no way yes. you're staying still. Yes. Like this for more than five seconds without even involving him. Yeah. Wow. Like, hey guys, what did you guys eat? Oh, I like her shoes. I wonder where she got. Where did you get those shoes? Wow. Now you're much more action. Wow. We are learning every day. Chris is learning every day. Yes. So, so are we also learning? Oh, man, it's my job to spread some love and uh, <laughs> teach you guys what took me a Thank couple so of years much. to learn. You are so humble and I like the way you are supporting us. Even yeah. again, you are, you are mentoring us. Yeah. Now, can I ask you something about your tattoo? Sure. Which is your favorite? I can see no, you. No, I don't have a favorite. It's, <laughs> we're just like tattoos from around the world. So let me just focus on one if you yeah, don't mind. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> pick one. Which one are we uh, going to pick? Let me. I, I like. I like. Okay. Ah, so. This one, time. I got this in Miami, Florida. Time is running out all yeah. the time. Time. And these numbers are the years I've been married. So every year. Ah, okay. Look, eight, nine. I did this one myself. Okay. Nine. This is my 11th year anniversary. Wow. So for my wife, they're all over my body. I don't even know what number that is. 13. So I've been married 18 years. So it goes oh, up wow. to 18 somewhere. Wow. So I guess those are my most important. There's my 10th year. 10th year. Wow. My kids' birthdays. Wow. 
How old is your first one? Uh, first is 17 years 17 old. Now. Yeah. Are they vloggers? No, not yet. Uh, I don't know if they're really into it. Okay. Maybe I don't know. Ah. Uh -huh. Not yet. But you see that you're 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 learning already. <laughs> <laughs> Even the distance. <laughs> Yeah. Man, if you so, want to tell somebody something sad, yeah. you don't want the camera to be like this. Yeah. You want to be like, guys, I had the worst day. Let me tell you about it. And then get up and walk. Wow. Okay, we're walking. Look, the butcher's there now. Yeah. Like, he could be a character. Yeah. You know, how many of these goats do you cut up a day? Uh, you know, where are you getting the goats? Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? I, I'm getting you. I'm getting you. So, guys, I'm so pleased we are with Christmas list. Yes. And my brother here, can you give yourself? Peter C7. Yeah, that's my YouTube channel. Yeah, so I and you got to get a tripod so you can flip it around. You can transition smoother. Oh yeah. Easier than holding it like this. Yeah, we have a tripod, but sometimes you know this one is so easy when I'm recording. Like there's a way. There's a time I was in Nairobi. No, when when you are holding this camera like this, no yeah. one knows that you are recording. And some people don't like cameras. To them. I don't want to swear, but I'll say <laughs> forget them. Mm -hmm. Just go. Who cares? Oh, who cares? Who cares if you upset people? <laughs> okay. The world's always upset. <laughs> Create good videos. Oh, wow. So thank you guys. Guys, go to Chris, Ma uh, Chris Masley's channel. Yeah. Also support him. Yeah, I appreciate it. So that, that he can be able to reach to 1 million subscribers. That is his goal. One so, at a time, man. One at a time. Yeah, one at a time. Even if they come two to three, they. You see? I love it. I appreciate it. I, yeah. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to talk on your channel. I appreciate yeah. that. Thank you so much, guys. Now, let, let, <clears throat> let's, let's see each other at the Tanzanian-Kenya border. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.